Hey everyone, welcome back. Baji bringing you some more Motorsport Manager here today. We've got a fight on our hands. Well, we're first here with Firebird, eh? Really struggling, but glanced at this before I hit record. They're no, not only are they no longer in first with that uh, rule break, they're in third. So that was a huge uh, hit to Firebird there. Hopefully we'll get some, some good results here today. As a result. Don't think there's a whole lot to do here. I mean, you've got, um, sorry, we've got, we've got a repair car from last race. Before we look at this. Okay. Yeah, we really want to get our reliability up. It was kind of an issue last, last race, but at the same time, Got to have these engines. These should be done pretty soon, yeah. And then we can, uh... Go all in... On reliability improvements. Although we've got gearboxes to do, too. Things to do. Things to do. Okay. All them sponsor offers. Okay, that's the engines done. I don't think, uh, I think we can still ignore this for right now. Okay, so 577 is the best engine on the grid. These don't have a whole lot to offer. Uh, let's do this. Yeah, we'll do this for right now. This isn't going to speed up fast enough, so... 17, just to get those gearboxes in a decent spot. Okay, what do we got for sponsor offers? Everything's full here. This is the top end, I think? This. Okay, this is second or above, 13... Oh no, this is the mid-level. This is what we were getting before. Hmm. Fourth or above 800k. That seems pretty solid. It's a little bit more aggressive than the uh, sixth or above, but the sixth or above before was 800. No, it was 700. Yeah, we'll take this one. Pretty, pretty easy uh, pick there. Man, this one's really bad. Less than 150 per race. So a very easy pick here as well. Coffer is getting in a slightly better state. Four hundred per race. That twelve races four million though. So this is four, well, it's actually the same. This is 10 races for 4 million. This is 12 races for less than 4 million per race. So I guess we'll take uh, this middle offer. We don't really need the, the upfront cash so much. So we'll just take the best paying offer here. Straightforward trip to the sponsor bin. And I think we, yeah, we already did this, okay. And we're a long ways away from unlocking the ability to uh, improve our engine any further. Uh, yeah, I'll take, um, I'll take 500k. Seems decent. Where's my driver? What do you got? He got a... Uh, Got a perk. 
Oh. Damn. Ah, that could have been useful before I clicked the spawn went to the sponsors. Uh that sucks. Oh well. Yeah, four star sponsor level. Well, spec engines on the agenda. A tiger losing to me, apparently. Yeah, see, this is a lot easier to take. 80k for two places. Yeah. Okay. Let's go. One of the concerns for this course, with this circuit, is that the tire wear is very high. So it's interesting that so much of the AI has elected for... Oh, no. Damn it, Ingle. Well, I guess if you're going to do that, the best time to do that is now. Um... What was I saying? Oh, so I'm kind of surprised that the AI has chosen Super Soft. I guess we'll watch Marsh to start this one. Given that she's the one in traffic. So, yeah, I mean, this could be a three-stop race for some of these AIs. Depending on how hard they're pushing these uh, Super Soft tires. But we'll have to see how that goes. Oh, somebody crashed. Okay. You got a safety car? No safety car. Okay. Oh, and it was stone. That's a Firebird car. I don't know if that... I can't remember if that was the one who uh, had a... Who lost his engine or not. But if it wasn't, then Firebird is in a horrific spot for this race. Which is good for us! Okay. I think we can go ahead and push here. We only need about eight laps... ...out of each stint of tires. Ingle's already up into 13th. Yeah. I missed when he passed her. Here they come. Moving up the grid! Yeah, the first few laps... ...really rough. And then from there, strategies start to kind of take over. Yeah, all these super soft tires are, are starting to fall off. Wow, she's actually kind of cold. On temperature, okay. That's not what I was expecting. Where is she at? Okay, we can go ahead and have them go through. So this is her first pit stop. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and fill up? Yeah, I want to be able to run her on a really aggressive... Especially since she's got the... Um, the, the fuel quickness. Definitely want to go ahead and give her gas and we'll run her on a higher higher engine setting. Yeah, don't worry. Okay. So now he's coming. He's coming. He's coming. He's coming. Same deal here. Seems good, man. Okay, so we're gonna bring her back down to neutral. But, yeah, definitely running on high now at this point. Don't, don't push it, dude. Like, we've got more than enough car here. Although getting into the pits first, yeah. <laughs> okay, on to push. Wow, where are we? Holy crap. Did we really come out in third? What? What just happened? How did I... How did I exit? In such a high place? Well, I'll take it. Fourth, fifth. Pretty good spot to be. Oh, that was weird. 
Somebody exiting the pit must have driven off the road onto the grass there. Okay, so everybody's pit once. We're in a fantastic spot at the moment. Firebird in eight. I guess I should start, I should start paying attention to who was in uh, third and fourth now, too. Okay, let's go ahead and get her to push. Car condition's doing okay. And how, how hard do I want to go here? We still have six laps of fuel. Essentially. Okay, let's go. Having him on attack might be a little too aggressive, honestly. Because of tire wear being such a big issue. Oh. No, no overtaking in sector... Oh no, it's cleared, okay. Okay, looks like she got him, finally. Man, whoever's in first... He's just getting it done right now. Oh. Guess we could speed this up a little bit. Okay, let's take a look at Marsh. I need to know what's going on with her fuel situation here. I think we've got one more lap that we can go on her. Yeah, okay. So she's coming in here. Go ahead and put this to attack. Turns out my tire saving is doing, or my tire strategy is saving me quite a bit. See, she's got seven. I don't think I need quite that much. I may not run an overtake on this, on this last stent. For her. Okay. Are we gaining any ground here? Well, I guess the other guy pit. Okay. Yeah, so much gas. Yeah, we're going to lose a couple of spots. We gained one in the pit lane. Okay, so we come out in 5th, 6th. Not bad. And they've got what? They've got some pit, some pitting to do too. I might need to back her down. Let's go like this. Okay, up into 3rd and 4th, not bad. Like I said, Hiroshima still has to pit here. Uh, I might need to take him to high. Okay... Okay, 2nd and 3rd. Hiyaki is, is still in 6th. So that's the Firebird, but them not getting any points for this car is going to be great. I just need to make it count here. Okay, so she's still in Overtake. Two six, two four, two three. Okay, we're gaining. Yeah, this needs to come down for sure. Up to 1-5. Unfortunately, we've only got like a lap and a half to go. It may not be enough. Okay, 
One second. We gained half a second. And a half a lap. Oh my gosh. Uh, yeah, I don't feel comfortable enough pushing this any further. Oh, get him! Make the move! Alright. Just in time. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh my god! I ran a fuel right at the end with both cars. I had double podium. Oh my god. Denied. I was so focused on watching. Ran out of gas right on that final straight, right after that last corner. Uh, oh well. Still a good race. Okay, so Vexel and Zampanelli, or Zampelli. Vexel finished 10th. And Zampelli's down here. Yeah. Clearly they have got... I mean, maybe they had one car that's decent and the other's not. Like, there's no double finish up high. Yeah. Okay. Man. <laughs> that finish, though. Yeah, that's a huge jump. We were tied. We picked up 20 points on Firebird. Okay, so so Vexila is in third. They're within striking distance. Zampelli's not even close. So honestly, it's between Firebird and Vexila and, and us. Yep, nothing really to see here. Happiness still at 100. That's nice, though. Only paying 300k for a race. And just because I'm that kind of guy... Okay, still not going to give me any extra cash. All right. Hope against hope there. Yeah, I'm going to say no to that. Given that I've got the best engine on the grid. Just in case. Just... This suspension. <laughs> Just that. Okay. Uh, go like this. We'll just finish these things up. Are finally getting better according to this chart, despite the fact that we're leading the championship. Harbert's still in third, so they've not been able to pick up that uh, engine back up to where it was. We want to see. Hey, this was Guilford, right? Up speed. Okay. Just trying to figure out. If there's something I need to be worried about with those other teams as far as their parts are concerned, but I don't think so. So we're just going to go to race. And yeah, I continue to take the slightly safer pick here, despite this finishing. Alrighty. Going with a conservative start here again. Oof. Big drive off. Okay. A lot more of the soft runnings. Soft tire is choice from the AI. It is another high wear, high tire wear uh, track. Wow, look at this pack. That's kind of insane. All right, they can start to spread out now. Yeah, go Marsh. Get up in there. Conte. Oh, that's the Zabelli guy. Gonna have a... Is their team coming on? I mean, they're still... Vexala is the one that's close. Zamp Zampelli is really far behind. Oh, wow, well, something just happened there. I'm sitting there looking at UI and not the track. Come on, guys. Okay, let's get her up to, to push. Oh, crash. Well, that's an that's another Firebird crash. I mean, I, I can't laugh too much because, I mean, I have one of my guys crashed too. 
Yo, Inglehart in 10. He's in perfect form at the moment. Okay, where are we at? 44%. Yeah, you can see that the tire wear is really starting to affect Marsh here. In fact, it's it's so aggressive. Like, I actually am going to switch her to overtake because there's no way she's making it to lap 8 at this rate. Where is she? She's in 10th. 22%. Okay, we're going to go one more. Maybe that was uh, a little aggressive. Yes, yeah, 6 to 8. Okay, we're going to switch her to medium. Uh, go with balanced. Okay. Inglehart. Go ahead and push him to overtake here. He's definitely got the gas. Might as well burn it off. Yeah, 22. Okay. Move her back down to high here. 6 to 8 laps on soft is just absurd. Burns up those tires super quickly. Okay, so no mistakes. Good pit. Good pit. Oh, 10. We're, on, we're in that cliff. Thankfully, it didn't last very long. Oh, and we had a jack problem. So coming out in 11th isn't the worst. Oop. There we go. Okay. So Marsh up front. We've got five pits to go still. Ooh. A repair from somebody in second. That's huge. Will we come out ahead of all of them? Yeah. Okay. So on track in third... Marsh is. Let's take a look at condition here. Oh yeah, we're doing great. Get in there, Englehart. Okay. Third, fifth. Third, fourth on track. Okay. Vexala in first, though. Don't be sad about you not being able to get past your teammate. Doing just fine. You need to be careful about gas. Let's do this. Uh, 16. I think I need to get hurt on medium, actually. This might be the stint that we, we go the one extra lap. Let's bring these all these down. Just trying to hold position here in third, fourth. Until we get uh, the next pit. Yeah, the second Vex car moving up. It's in sixth now. We're right on the tail of this uh, dude in second, though. Yeah, I hope she's got enough tire to last. I did run her and push for a little while, I think, so I might just have to leave her on neutral if I have to pit early. Thankfully, the medium tires, the cliff is really low on condition. Yeah, they're both driving in great form.
We're losing ground here, though. Uh, third, 15. Okay, let's go like this. Well, I don't want to go too low. I'll turn... You know what? We're just going to pit her in. We're just going to go pit. It's fine. And then run on neutral. And let's see, 10 laps. 5, 6, 7, 8, okay. Yeah, she's gonna stick here for a little while. And I need to bring, I need to just bring in uh, Inglehart here as well. His tires are in a horrific state. And that wing. Need to get every, all my reliabilities up. Okay, here we go. Second also pit. I think I can run him on high though. Let's see pet a little bit more recently. For engine mode at least. Okay, so we're in 10th, 11th. Everybody in front of us has to pit except for one. Okay, a couple positions there. Come on, Marsh. I actually want Marsh to let Inglehart buy, but I don't want to tell her to do so. There we go. I've always had bad luck with that. First and second, yeah. Zempelli with the, uh, the part repair, that's huge. Okay, so we're on track in third, fourth. Vexala is still up there. In a great position. Okay, so all the pits are done. Question is, when are we going to start making a move here? Because we're still losing ground to the leader. Yeah, that gap just continues to open up. Oh, she's losing ground to Gayaki as well. Gayaki. Four. Okay, I think we can go to high here for her. Yeah, she lost. Wow, I missed it. It was close, and now the gap is huge. Okay, third at least on the screen now. Three seconds back. And probably start to push here. On tires. I mean, second's gonna... Probably flirt with that cliff. Is what I'm thinking here. Oh, under investigation for a cut corner. Okay, cool. Oh, he's gonna pit as well. Yeah, you're done. Free position for my team here. Two laps. Oh, she's gotta go down to medium. He's low on gas, too. In fact, I'm just gonna bring him down to medium, too. The gap is just so big. I don't think I need to... That's not doing anything. We might as well go here. Uh, let's go ahead and look at this. Yeah. I mean, maybe we can get this extra spot with Marsh. Kind of doubt it, honestly. There's not enough time left. Yeah, just a couple of corners here to go. Okay. Second, fifth, not the greatest. 
Still points, though. Yeah, Zampelli just really cruising up there. Fourth, sixth for them. What? 10 second penalty for corner cuts that said no action taken? Thankfully, we still end up in second. We were just that far ahead. Yeah. Damn it, Velko. Yeah, Zappelli kind of moving up. They don't have the points to really challenge at the moment, like not after eight rounds, but their car is clearly improving. And yeah, Firebird got... Wait, no. Firebird crashed. Yeah, Firebird crashed. Pretty decent gap there. Which is really good because that last race with its double points is going to be a... to be tight. And opening a gap would make it a lot more comfortable. Just 280. Would have liked to see. Banking them bucks. I mean, we've continued to extend our lead here today in the uh, championship series, which is fantastic, of course. 36 points, 38 points to Vexala. Yeah, fourth, fourth and below is essentially out of this uh, championship race. It's between the top three here with a promotion to the Asia Pacific Cup on the line here, which is kind of what we need. I mean, if the challenge is going to have any sort of hope of being alive, we kind of have to be promoted this year. So, thanks everybody for watching. I shall see you next time.